just not talk then. Are you filming? Action. Action. Are you filming? Cool. So here today I am at Edinburgh Comic Con and I am inking this quite eccentric picture which combines apes, I guess, gorillas, with uh, the 2000D character Strontium Dog. So I guess he's Strontium Ape. That's his name. That's what we're going to call him. A rather difficult helmet, which doesn't make a whole lot of sense to me, but I think kind of works. You having a good time, Debs? Debs? I'm nodding. No, don't leave me hanging. Debs? You said yeah, okay, that's fine. For any, any sort of process nerds out there, I am using the Faber Castell super fine pen to do the, uh, the sort of bulk of the lines and then I think in a minute obviously when I'm working at home I tend to work a lot more slowly and with a degree more finesse I say that but I am slightly lying about it actually um, and once I put in these kind of thinner lines I'll go in afterwards with a Pentel brush pen and uh, you know, like that. Do the what do you call it? Spot blacks. That is a random man in the background. It's basically been occasionally just when you start to feel relaxed just will stop bellowing. Isn't that right, Debs? It's Wolf. Is it Wolf shouting? Yeah. Christ Almighty. Good God. Now that bit of music playing in the background is more than a feeling by, I think, Boston? Is that right? Debs wouldn't know that. Debs doesn't know anything about any, any <laughs> pop culture, really. Uh, of any kind, even stuff that's from like 1982. Nothing. No, is that right? Uh, that was me. That was Debs. She's uh, started to hit me. She beats me, uh, people at home. Just so you know, she beats me. Isn't that right, Debs? Yes. Yeah. See. I'll pay for that later on. For that comment. How's it look? It's really good. Thank you. I hope the guy agrees. This really is a lot quicker than I would normally work. Lots of Ramita style cracks all over everything. I can actually see at the corner now, I can see the drawing at the corner of my eye. That's quite good. Let's look at it. Hey, that's not bad. This is so sort of satisfying and pleasing. I'm thinking maybe I should start drawing like this all the time. What do you think, Debs? No, well, yeah, actually, that is quite satisfying. But drawing with a pen and then going in afterwards with a brush pen to do the um, the sort of darker areas, kind of this. I think this is what you would call quite modern, isn't it, Debs? Oh yeah, modern. Modern. That's right. I'm doing a terrible thing to Debs. I asked Debs to film this for me, uh, and now I'm betraying her by making her speak on the camera, and she did not sign up for that. Is that right, love? That's correct, yeah. For these nice, cool boots. You never know, I might show this to the guys at 2000 AD and they might think, yep, this is a character <laughs> whose time has come. Later on, all of this patter, I will 
reproduce for these people here when they come back for their drawing. And uh, I'll try and make it sound as natural as I possibly can, as though it's the first time I've ever said it. I don't know if that's cynical or not, I'm not sure. No. I'm usually a lot more fun than this. I'm trying to concentrate. Aren't I, love? Hello, Debs. <laughs> I'm, usually a lot more, I'm usually a lot more fun than this. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, I understand, love. child laughing in the background there like Woody Woodpecker. Okay, I think that's, that's the line come. Right, I think what we'll do now is rub out pencil. Should just leave a fairly nice tight drawing. Adding some spotlights here to the gun. Men in cloaks walking by now. If you stopped every time a man in a cloak walked by in this place, you'd never get anything done. It's true, isn't it? It's very much cloak city. Quite jealous, actually. I'm going to say some jealous. Quite fancy a cloak. Deb's going to have a cloak. Debs. Sorry? Can I have a cloak? Um, no. no, that's what I thought. Not well. It's the Pentel pocket brush I'm using here. Which is quite good. It does have a nasty tendency to sort of break up when you're trying to do very smooth sort of sweeping lines even on this very smooth paper it breaks up a little bit it's still pretty good it gives a sort of broad effect of the brush mm. good please do keep banging blowing butt balloons when I'm trying to draw that's great Do this. Let's do this. Gorilla's tits. That's that famous film, isn't it, from the 80s, love, isn't it? Debs. I was just saying I'm drawing the gorilla's tits, which is that famous film from the 1980s with Scotty Weaver. Yeah, yeah. Absolute classic film. A very sad film about gorilla's tits, actually. Very sad, but good. Good. Well worth. It. If you've not seen it, a true story. That's right. Uh, and if you've not seen it, do see that, it is quite good. That guy, who is a Klingon today, normally works in tax. That's his deal, taxation. And he tends to conduct himself quite differently. Which is fair, if you think about it. about it, isn't it? Yeah? What do you think, love? Yeah, good. Got some shadow in there. Underneath his arms. A bit, a bit of dimensionality anyway. And this is gun, just slightly botched, but never mind. You managing there, alright, love? You managing right there?
Okay. You say that stuff? Huh? What do you think? It's good. Yeah? Do a shadow underneath them to root them in the world. Oops. That's it. Thank you. Okay. Nice. We'll probably put some cool heavy metal music on this later on to really make it. Dig it, 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 dig it. Yeah, that's it. Dig it, dig it, dig it, dig it. Drawing time. Zoom in and out. Awesome. Okay, that's it. Bye bye.